Long before the influx of Europeans into North America, the native tribes had a history of traditional medicine that had been passed down from generation to generation with ancient wisdom. From Alaska and the wilds of Canada down to Central America, there is an abundance of natural medicine growing. Most of the herbs are indigenous, but some of them were introduced five centuries ago by settlers and have now taken root, firmly becoming part of the American plant family. Herbal medicine is widely practiced in Central America, with the tradition being that illness is caused by a loss of balance between hot and cold elements in the body. Therefore, the healer needs to restore the balance and vitality, such as the herbal medicine practice in Mexico, with communities preferring to use local herbs and plants as opposed to conventional drugs. Many of the herbs are also valued for their magical powers, as well as their healing qualities, with some herbs including rituals and spiritual ceremonies. The shaman's role is to heal sick people by reaching out to the spirit world through ceremonies in order to heal both the individual and the community as a whole. Different herbs were used in different tribes to heal different illnesses, and always with respect to Mother Earth and the Great Creator. The European settlers dismissed these rituals along with the mastery of the herbs, claiming it to be primitive and savage. Herbal medicine went into a steep decline in the early 1900s, as both finance and support were withdrawn at medical schools for learning about herbal medicine in favor of modern conventional medicine. However, a legislation was passed in 1994 and gradually the traditional use of herbs increased with people realizing that taking natural plants and herbs as medicine boosts the immune system, increasing the resistance to infection and also speeding up the healing of wounds. Courses were reinstated and resources began to be put into research into herbal medicine. Also, happily, there has recently been a great awakening amongst the population and buying natural herbs for treating ill health and maintaining well-being has once again risen to reclaim its place in the natural choice of living healthily. <music>